guys I'm here with another star looks looks book um, so this one is called revival um, and everything that I have here on my face today well not everything all the colored products that you see are from star looks so it's a little bit of this and it's a little bit of other star looks products that, that I have in case you're wondering star looks it's um, this particular one the looks books it, it comes in a little container like this it has a uh, little information in the back and on when you oh, it's got three products on the inside and then they give you a little picture guide here of what you can do and how you can do similar looks or a look using what's available inside the looks book so I think that's pretty cool so you can use that as a guide so um, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you everything that I did um, to get this look today so the first thing that they have in here this is called Agave. Um, this is an eyeshadow duo. It just has like a dark burgundy, um, burgundy color and a for like a forest green. These are really dark, dark colors. Um, great for fall. And um, what I did was I took a little bit of the burgundy and I put it on a brush and, and I put that on the outer corner. And then I have the dark green shade and I put that right, right, right on the outside after I had applied all of my burgundy shade all over the outside corner. I also have the green on the underside of from last month's looks book. This is the Tropic and the Ritz. I have both of these colors on my eyelid, um, kind of blending them out until I got the proper color that I was looking for. Um, these are also great for highlight and cheek colors too. Um, so I went ahead and, and just did that. I, I, I like the way that it came out. I thought it, it came out really, really nice. Um, you do have to work with this, add it little by little, blend it out, add a little bit more, blend it out so that it's not gonna be too harsh and too difficult to blend out. But if you use it wisely and little by little, you'll be good to go. Also lasts all day. So this lip color, give it some time to set and dry on your lips. I did put a little bit of um, lip balm on my lips before I applied it, but I can tell you that the lipstick, it is very, very drying. Even with the lip balm on it, it feels just very dry on the lips and it kind of tugged at the lips as I was applying it. So it is a very dry formula, but mm, it kind of transfers a little bit, but not as much as you would expect for it to be such a bright, bright color. And that is it right there. It's super bright and bold. Um, it's not something that I naturally gravitate to, but it is really, really pretty. And I did use is this blush that I got, um, I think it was last month. They have another subscription service where you can pick your products. And that's where I got this one from. That one is a really good subscription as well. Um, and then I used this liner that I got. It's a liquid liner. This is a really amazing liner. This is a super black, black line and um, it's really easy to work with. The felt tip is really great and I like the way that it, that I can handle it. I can do a really nice straight line. I usually just work little by little, um, little tiny strokes until I get the line that I want. If I do one swoop, I always mess it up. So I just go little by little. And for my brows, I um, got this. This is the Sheena Marie Starlux um, Brow Palette. There's four shades in here. And I just used a combination of the darkest color and the medium color down here. I just kind of blended them together. I, I used more of the lighter shade on the front of my brow and the darker shade towards the, the back of the brow. Um, oh yeah, and I also used the lightest shade here um, on my brow bone as well. So I have that here. I also have it as a highlight here. Okay, and then lastly is the mascara. This mascara, this mascara is called Flora. Um, it is a really small wand. Um, personally for the mascara, um, it lengthens, but I really like a mascara that's gonna be thickening up my lashes a lot. Now you can still see it. I think it did, it did a decent job, but I just prefer va va boom lashes. If you like something for lengthening, I think this will be a really good thing for lengthening if you don't need all the volume like I do. Um, so it was really nice doing that, but I prefer lots and lots and lots of volume. So overall, really nice. I like the way that it's packaged, as always, very nice. And I like the little guide that's on the inside as well. This is the look that I got with using all the Starlux products. I hope you guys enjoyed this. 
Um, again, if you're interested in checking out the monthly looks books, it's very different every month. And they always give you a little guide here in, on the inside of what you can do, how you can use the products. And it comes in this nice little travel case that you can keep together. Um, and it's pretty cool. I mean, you can ha actually put it on your counter and like, they do look like little tiny books. So um, yeah, if you're interested, I'll have the link down below. Go ahead and check it out. Uh, let me know what you think on how I did. And I will see you again in another video.